You know, in my relentless attempt to be the living embodiment of this meme, it only makes sense that I keep my finger on the pulse of what's popular amongst high school kids these days. That is the saddest shit I ever heard. Well, you're not gonna see me crying, that's for sure, Nigel, because I know the importance of keeping up with the latest trends. So let's see what's uh, crack a lacking <laughs> as, of, uh, as of late. You're gonna regret that, dog. Yeah, we'll see. Siri, play me something popular. Shut up, fat ass. Hi, you must be new. Yeah, this is a new hydro flask. Oh, you don't have one? Um, how do you make your friendship bracelets then? That's kind of weird. Hmm. Well, save the turtles. Um, oh, these? Nope. everyone and welcome back to a brand new soap carving contest. My name is Leon Lush and I am fat with gratitude that you decided to spend some time here with me today. Get out the way, e-girls. The Visco Girl takeover is in full swing and showing no sign of slowing down. Now, what is a Visco Girl, you may ask? And that's a great question and I'm so glad you asked, but it's a bit of a layered answer. And you may be fully aware already what it is if you're skewing a bit younger, but perhaps you were like I was just a few days ago, blissfully ignorant to what it was. You had seen the term thrown around a few times, but you never cared to look any deeper. Uh, and I don't blame you, but at the request of some of my subscribers and some people on Instagram uh, to do a video on this, here we are. I went ahead and immersed myself the last two days and it was, uh, wow. What a thank you so much for this wonderful recommendation. Well, it was nice meeting you. And Ayoop, and Ayoop. And Ayoop, you forgot yours? I guess we'll just have to sacrifice you to the e-girls. So I'm like really into saving the turtles lately. So I got a metal straw. You don't have one? That's fine, because I have like 20. Do you want some? Here, you can have it. Oh, hey there. Hey. This, this is my hydro box. You don't have one? Then how do you make your friendship reflect? Hmm. Weird. Oh, my shell choker. Just stop. You don't have one of these either? Just stop. It's okay. So after consuming several hours of this content during my research to try and get a grip on what this phenomenon was, turns out I got radiation poisoning. No, no, I'm only teasing. I, I only lasted a few minutes. I mean, we're talking like 1986 Chernobyl levels of radiation. I couldn't go for hours. That would be insane. Today, we are becoming the ultimate Visco girls. But our parents have kind of cut us off, especially me, since I graduated. So they're they're trying to teach us the, the value of money. So aesthetical. And that you, finally, she's gone. Oh, and she also left her AirPods here. And that you, but that you, these are very Visco. You'll probably catch them wearing wearing a scrunchie. I'm already on trend. Tube top, hookah shell necklace, white bands or Birkenstocks, and don't forget the Hydro Flask to finish off the look. So all this really is, when you boil it down, is a new age iteration of the basic white girl meme that's been around for years. It's just a new aesthetic that's gone viral typically among affluent white teenage girls characterized by several things. Fortunately, there's plenty of starter pack memes to help us out. The Hydro Flask and reusable metal straw are key because the Visco girl is always casually environmentally aware and they want to make sure the oceans are safe for future turtle populations. Save the turtles! They love Birkenstocks, lip balm, decorated Crocs, checkered vans, AirPods, weird Swedish designer backpacks, wave rings, wearing scrunchies up and down their arms and whatever this nonsense facial spray is. <gasps> and most importantly, they're bringing back the shell necklace, which I love because they were cool for about 20 minutes when I was in seventh grade, which for reference was right around the time JFK was assassinated. You know, after reading that out loud, I think what happened is a bunch of teenage white girls just stole the lesbian aesthetic and renamed it something for themselves. Now, it's no surprise that TikTok is in large part responsible for the propagation of this nonsense, but one search on YouTube and you realize that every single teenage female YouTuber, with no exceptions, has made a becoming the ultimate Visco girl video. I'm not even kidding. If you're a teenage YouTuber and you haven't made a video about becoming a Visco girl for a day, just delete your channel. 
it's not gonna work out for you. Today, I am going to learn how to be a visco girl. Visco -y. Ultimate visco girl. Becoming the ultimate visco girl. Today, I'm going to be transforming myself into a visco. Visco girl transformation slash living like a visco girl for a day. I'm transforming into a visco girl. Y'all knew I was basic. I've been seeing this video go around so much on YouTube right now. Why don't I turn into a visco girl? Visco girl. 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 to mention that the term visco girl was coined because of a photo editing app that was actually released in 2011 that's just become very popular amongst kids mostly over the last several years i downloaded it it's actually not a bad app it's very similar to instagram it's got a ton of functionality tons of filters uh it's even got a social aspect to it but without the vanity metrics like likes and follow so it removes that barrier for a lot of people i think that are worried about not getting enough likes which is an interesting topic for a whole nother video so what's the big deal then you're probably wondering right it's an aesthetic it's a style it's teens being teens who cares they want to bring back seashell necklaces and like oversized t-shirts and lululemon they're obsessed with hydro flask and metal straws they're saving the environment saving the turtles after all what's the problem I'll show you what the goddamn problem is. And a oop, 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 and a oop. Save the turtles out of oop. And a oop, and a oop, and a oop, and a oop. What the hell is that? All right, this is where I draw the line in the sand. All right, it's one thing to, to dress a certain way uh, or enjoy a particular aesthetic that's become very popular, but it's a whole nother ball game when you start acting like your brain's been infected by a parasite that's now rendered you useless. And I oop, 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 and I oop. Shut up! Calm down, Leon. It's just a meme for TikTok. They don't really act that way. Well, take a look at this. So I was walking to one of my classes and a freshman was passing by me and she yelled out omg i forgot my hydro flask and i oop and her friends responded with oh my god oop 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 so basically i just want to know like do other schools have freshmen that actually say that shit because i thought it was just a joke on tiktok we didn't actually think you guys were gonna say that shit at school. It was a joke. What? I I, I don't I don't understand. I I, I don't. I've seen it a million times, right? Something starts to trend, and everyone starts to act a certain way, ironically, because it's funny. <laughs> And then it gets so ingrained, so culturally deep, and persists for so long that we all wake up one day, and kids are all of a sudden acting like this unironically, and they don't even know how they got there. I will not stand for this. I will not sit idly by breathing the same oxygen as these as these parasites masquerading around on my planet as humans. We must act now. But while we think of a plan, let's watch just one more. Visco girls be like. Save the turtles. Yeah. Ew, is that a plastic straw? Here, have my hydro flask. Out of scrunchies? Oh. Here, just borrow mine. All right, that wasn't bad. I'll give it to her. I don't mind the beatbox. But if I'm being honest, she's got me in the mood for a bit of a remix. Overused SpongeBob meme. Visco girls be like. Scrunchies, Birkenstocks, and weird designer backpacks. Please support my cause. Save the turtle dab. Poster child for a female white affluent teenager. Everyone hold up your metal straws. Ooh, turtle dab. rich dripping in friendship bracelets. My TikTok followers know that I'm basic. So hold your hydro flask in the air and reapply your lip gloss. And I oop. Now believe me when I tell you that I am just as worried as you are about this visco girl epidemic. That's why I've gotten together with some of the most prolific thought leaders in teenage behavioral sciences, and we have devised a foolproof plan of how to put an end to this once and for all. <sighs> That's right, baby. This is a large Dunkin' Donuts plastic straw. Oh my goodness, look at this. Look at the majesty of this, just all plastic. 
I can smell the dead turtles on that. <laughs> this plastic straw is Visco Girl Kryptonite, and according to the models that we've created due to our extensive research, we found that if we use a plastic straw to kill a turtle, it will put every Visco Girl on this planet in a never-ending feedback loop of tears and despair. An exploitable glitch in the Visco Girl matrix, if you will, of which there is no coming back from, so now there is only one thing left to do. Turtles near me. You can call me stupid Yes, you can call me sheep You can say I'm lame